Donald Trump, we have now learned, thanks to Bob Woodward's book Rage, supposedly bragged about a secret nuclear weapon system when he was speaking to Bob Woodward during these interviews that took place over the last six months for Bob Woodward's book. This is according to excerpts from the book that have been released. Uh, Trump talked openly about a weapon system with Bob Woodward that is supposed to be secret. And this was in the context of telling Bob Woodward how close we supposedly were to war with North Korea, nuclear war in 2017, which is a whole horrifying nightmare in and of itself. And according to the excerpts that The Washington Post has published, Trump told Bob Woodward, quote, I have built a nuclear, a weapon system that nobody's ever had in this country before. We have stuff that you haven't even seen or heard about. We have stuff that Putin and she have never heard about before. Uh, saying there's nobody. What we have is incredible. And then in the book, Bob Woodward goes on to say unnamed sources that he spoke to and said, what what is Trump talking about here? Sources did confirm the existence of a new weapon system to Bob Woodward, but they said they couldn't share any details and they expressed surprise that Donald Trump actually mentioned it to Bob Woodward because he wasn't supposed to. Uh, the Hill then reached out to the Pentagon for comment. The Pentagon said they don't talk about books that have not yet been published. And um, when the Hill did more investigation into this, they spoke to, for example, James Acton from the Carnegie Endowment for International Peace. And uh, what James Acton said is this probably is a submarine launched low yield nuclear warhead. and its existence is now known, but the details remain classified. This is so. So there's two sides to this. One is we shouldn't even have this stuff. We need nuclear disarmament and maybe Trump spilling the beans will help build that case. The other side is Donald Trump is just so irresponsible with classified and secret information. And he criticized Hillary Clinton for that. And he criticizes Adam Schiff and uh, Chuck Schumer and Nancy Pelosi for that. And yet it's Trump who has the record of bragging about new weapons that are publicly uh, uh, unknown or semi known and disclosing details. Remember the thing about the supersonic missile that goes super duper missile that goes 17 times the speed of sound or whatever. Uh, Remember Donald Trump in the Oval Office spilling secrets from an ally to Russian spy recruiter Sergei Kislyak on and on and on. But on the tail end of this, It's not new that Donald Trump is irresponsible with information, and much of it is because of his narcissism, which I will get to. Consider that Donald Trump's kids have access to a lot of this information. Who has Jared Kushner told about this stuff? What has Ivanka done or Don Jr. with knowledge of these things? Uh, And this is the classic attention seeking behavior of a narcissist. I've known many serial liars in my life. They're very toxic, very, very toxic. Sometimes they straight up for attention, say things that are lies. I knew someone I remember who said my glasses are five hundred dollars. No, they're not. And if they were, I wouldn't even care. Just they they want attention and they say straight, straight up lies. Others will say things that are true, but that they really shouldn't be talking about. Uh, Sometimes narcissists will in order to get attention, they will um, reveal a secret that a third party told them that they really shouldn't be revealing as an example. And that is that that is part of what Donald Trump does. And he does his fair share of lying as well. Imagine the things he's told people that we don't know he's told people and imagine what our adversaries are quietly doing with that knowledge. This man is a danger. He is a danger and he may get four more years if we don't do the right thing. Let me know what you think. I'm on Twitter at D Pacman. Glad you're with us today. Remember, next week we're on vacation. The show is okay. We're not canceled. We're just going to going on vacation next week, but we've still got a full show today. One of our sponsors today is Vincero Watches, and they're giving you up to 30 percent off everything in their store when you go to davidpacman.com slash watch. If you're looking for an awesome way to update your look, the perfect way to do it is with an elegant, high quality wristwatch. When there's a company like Vincero, there is no reason to go spending thousands of dollars on a watch. Vincero is an American company that's made it possible to own an excellent watch without breaking the bank. All of their watches are masterfully built 
with high end materials, but they're all in the range of about 150 to 250 bucks. I just got a watch from their Icon Automatic collection. The one I got is in gunmetal and slate blue. I love the look. It's sleek, classy. It's clear that a lot of careful craftsmanship went into the design. It is definitely my new favorite watch. You'll get up to 30% off everything in their store when you go to davidpackman.com/watch. I've put the link right underneath this video.